guys this is mast and welcome back to some more smite conquest today we're playing something a little offbeat we're doing some sylvana support and i'm actually doing it because i want to do it whoa whoa playing support because it's fun maybe maybe not i don't know um <laughs> because we've done some games with skipper lately because i've played with him a decent amount and he's been grinding the shit out of sylvanas um I've been kind of more tempted, and then the other day I popped into to Genetic Stream, who, if you guys don't know, is one of like the better SPL supports, and he had this nasty Sylvanas build that's actually really, really sick. I think it's a super cool build. It's actually pretty fun. Uh, it's one of those things where it's like you're actually a support, but you also get to do damage, and for me, that's always, like, that's when support actually gets to be fun. Bing! Huge! Oh my god, the poke is insane. Look at that Sunder go. Now it's only two more minutes before before we get to do it again. Sort of. You get two charges, but it's still a two-minute two, two minute cooldown for each charge, which is kind of awkward. I'm pretty sure it's for each charge, right? I feel like it'd be dumb if it didn't work that way, right? Am I wrong? Hang on. We do some of this. We do some... The button didn't go. There we go. We do some of that. Jingwei's getting absolutely bodied. <laughs> oh my god, man. Yeah, you want to get a little more of that? So yeah, we're going to play a little Sylvanas support today. The build we're looking to go into is um, Manticore Spikes, Relic Dagger. I, I don't know what the exact order is going to be. Early game Manticore Spikes, Relic Dagger eventually, maybe Phase Earring. I went that last game, didn't feel all that worth. Um, so maybe. And if, if we do, it'll probably be later on than I went at last game. Last game, I went at like third and that just like did not seem remotely worth it. But, but I think going at late game might be good. Like, it's actually a pretty decent item. It's just, it's it's an item you're not going to buy that much just because it's it's a healing support item, basically, right? So, um, and it mostly gets abused by, like, spam healers. So, so not as much Sylph. More like a Changa or a, uh... <laughs> it really didn't matter. I feel like I kind of clapped him right there. Uh, more like a Changa or Guan or something. Hang on, give me that level three. Huge pull. Tech! It didn't work. I'm figuring out the timing, man. There's this uh, actual, hang on, hang on, we actually get a kill. Are you, okay, thank God. If she didn't die to the tick, I was gonna be so sad, man. Um, yeah, Skipper was talking to me. I don't know if this is a known thing or not. I don't really see other, like I haven't really seen SPL supports do it, given I don't tend to focus on the SPL supports when I'm watching them play SPL. And normally I'm not popping by Genetic Stream. I just did the other day, which by the way, if you guys wanna learn support, I actually think Genetic's absolute God tier support. Uh, I think he's really entertaining to, to learn it at all. I really don't try and learn support, so it's not that relevant for me, but but I do think he's actually really, really good for it. And especially because he's somebody that, uh, he does a really good job, like, blending his play style in between, like, casuals and ranked and SPL and all that stuff. Like, he's really good at fitting his team and, and just doing what's good, which is pretty cool, which is something that people lack sometimes. It's pretty easy for the support players, like, SPL support's so different from other support that uh, a lot of the time they end up playing, like, very different than, uh, than like, a normal ranked support would because it just doesn't really translate that well. Yeah, the build is kind of fat, man. We get to do some stinky things with it. What I was going to say is um, the, the tech, man. Oh, my God, the pull tech is insane. I mess with it in jungle practice. It's really easy to do in jungle practice. I'm having trouble figuring out the timing on servers because, you know, in good old high-res fashion, it changes for some reason. <laughs> Ping matters way too much on everything ever. So, so yeah. Um, but basically what it is is when we three, we can whip around to a little 180. It doesn't have to be a 180. You can just turn. And if you time it right, the turn actually places whoever you're pulling in the pull based on where you're facing. So if we 180 with the right timing, instead of pulling somebody in front of our face, we can pull them behind us, which not only makes the pull longer, which is good, but you also get a body block them, which is really good. So it's got a lot of potential. It's something where like it's a little bit just more customization for the pull, but it's also something where you just generally basically get more CC out of it. And it doesn't really make the pull harder to hit because you just kind of pull and then you turn around. But what I've noticed is when we're playing on actual servers, even though my ping's not high, I just have it. It just exists. But when we're playing on servers, it seems like the timing's a lot more specific. We could alter, but she's Jingwei and she just mega dashes. So let's not do that. Pull! Game! I got trolled by my Heim. She gets to live. <laughs> right? She does. She does get to live. Damn it, man. Why? He probably didn't think about it. He probably didn't know. But oh my God, that knockup just ruined everything. We would have killed her so easy. So if you guys don't know, um, roots are now, I'm pretty sure before the recent DR change, they, they weren't, but they're now hard CC. 
which for Manticore Spikes is a pretty big deal. Uh, there aren't too many gods in Smite that would abuse Manticore Spikes that have roots. I think Sylv might be the only one. I can't immediately think of anybody. Hang on. You chilling? Oh, I want to do things to the... I want to do things to somebody, and I really just don't get to, do I? Okay. Yeah, we'll just keep you alive. Come here. Anybody want to get pulled in tower? Maybe? Why don't we get to pad our own stats when we pull somebody into tower? That's kind of messed up. I don't get any credit. Are you kidding? Dude, I can't hit this thing sometimes. I don't know what it is. Some Every once in a while, I feel like it's easier to hit the hard-ass pull, which is probably like hardest ability to hit in smite, um, than literally just basically the auto that is R1. It's like the same exact thing. Bang. All right, I'll go try and make myself useful. We'll go see if we get a gank left real quick. Yeah, Manticore Spikes procs off our pull, our ult, and our one, which is pretty dirty. Uh, you don't do the damage off the pull since the pull's not a damaging ability, but you do get the actual spike. Oh, she's just oom. Um. Hang on, we wait it out. Do the tech. Yeah, I can't. I swear I can't. <laughs> I really, <laughs> I really can't, man. Yeah, it's weird. I swear, like, I keep having stuff where I definitely turn in time. Like, they, they're not pulled yet. Like, they're getting pulled, but they're not pulled to their spot yet. And I'll turn, and it won't work. So I've been figuring out the timing. I've done it once or twice in a few games over the past, like, two days. So, so I will continue to try it, and once or twice we might get it. I don't know. Oh, God. Man, I wanted to be able to... Yoink. <laughs> wasn't, wasn't what I was going for. I wanted to be able to pull his three, but we just didn't get the timing. Oh, he might have hinted, though. Big body block. Huge body block. I wanted the kill, too. Because I'm greedy. Because I'm greedy. All right. Can I yoink your wave, Heim? Is that cool? It looks like it's cool. He's going to bank. He's not going to get it unless I sit here and tank the whole thing, which really isn't worth. So I think we'll do it real quick. And we'll try to not get soloed in the process. Not getting soloed is good. I guess it's not soloed, so, so that changes everything. If we die to two people, we could just be like, that's cringe. That's cringe. You guys need two people to kill me? Oh, he's going for it. My God. Get him. Huge tech. Yeah, I swear. <laughs> like that one, I was cranking my mouse to turn as soon as possible, and it's not working. So maybe I need to do it later. Maybe I actually need to delay it for some reason. I don't know, man. It doesn't matter too much. We're clapping anyways. Jing, come here. Oh, it's close. Now. Oh, it looked a little different. It didn't pull it, but it looked a little different. Dude, we are popping off on the silver right now. Oh my God, man. You guys ready for the God build? Hold up. Hold up. Yeah, this is about to blow your mind right here. Bing. Uh, we're going to wait in base real quick. And we're going to go Relic Dagger. And this upgraded Sunder is going to dumpster so hard. This thing is disgusting. Not only does it do a ton of damage, but um, it, it actually has an AoE, which I think they added recently. And just I don't buy Sunder, so I didn't even realize they added it. I'm assuming it was recent. I don't think it's been on that long. Um, and my last game, I hit, I think, four people with the AoE, which is not normal. But, <laughs> but it happened. Okay, it happened. I hit them with it late game. I don't remember if it was one or two of the Sunders. It was probably just one of the Sunders. No, I think it was two. Um, I did 2k damage total. I hit each of them for like 500. So <laughs> so it's capable of some crazy stuff, man. When a damage relic does 2k damage late game and you can build it on anybody and it does the same. Like that's absolutely wild, right? So so I think it might be good. I think it's capable of being strong. Obvious, a lot, obviously, a lot of the time just like shell is good and stuff like that. But I want to go for those damage items. I'm trying to pad stats, boys. See if we can help out with this. We're getting old right now. Oh, oh! Do we get to do a thing? Do the tech! I ever every time, every time. I just disappoint myself by trying. Bing! Give me my animosity. When do I get to do damage? Oh my God! Look at the oh the support diff is fat. Look at that root. I'm dying. <laughs> I'm going to be dying, please. Yeah, I just don't get to play the game right now. My God. Get off him. Hang on. We're stalling for backs. Eventually, our team gets to back. Oh, I pulled nobody. Nice. <laughs> it's, ex it's exactly what we wanted. I don't think there's a point in Sundering here. Is there? Fuck it. Huge Sunder. Yeah, they're all so low. It does a little damage. I think it would trigger everybody 
But I think it'd be kind of fun to make it so... Oh, I, I wanted to read that juke, man. We maybe could have clapped. I think if they made it so Sunder actually just did the damage and it wasn't based on current health, then they could nerf it to make up for it. I think it would honestly be acceptable. But it would piss people off so much. Oh, Pele, no. Damn it, man. I'm assuming she she might not have even missed stuff. Maybe we just don't get a kill. I figured we could kill there, though. All right, let me go get Relic Dagger. It's going to change our world because not only do we get two charges of Sunder, but we get low cooldown two charges that both have a lower cooldown, which is kind of nutty. So it goes from 110 seconds to 70 seconds with the Relic Dagger. And then that's 70 twice instead of 110 twice, which means total it goes from 140 for two to or from 220 to for, for two to 140 for two, which is pretty good. That's a pretty big swing. Yeah, living that support life. Don't mind me just soloing green for two years. Takes a little bit. Okay, I really want to solo somebody. We need our sunders up. Wait, what the? You nut? I wasn't even ready, man. I just whiffed. He's such a psycho. I just wasn't prepared. I'm trying to bait for Pele or like anybody. <laughs> for anybody that does damage. Come here. Did we get the proc? Did we? What? What happened to the I ate that thing. What happened to the proc? Man, I want to kill, but we don't have boys. I am bait. Somebody come here and murder, please. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my god, Pele, please press the button. Oh no. Dude, I am really trying right now, and we are just not getting follow-up. These guys all have ults. You gotta press the four button, boys. Oh, here, look at that AoE, man. Oh my god, the AoE. Okay, not the pull, but the AoE. I don't get to do shit. Hang on, give me the thing. Eventually, we maybe get to use it. Could be good. We check top damage. We're top damage. Come on. It's gonna be fine, Thoth. It's not going to be fine. It was all a trick. Come here, get bopped. No, stop. Yeah, we don't really do too much damage to Terra. Is it because she has a full Thebes? I think it might be. Yeah, we'll have to see. <laughs> I'm hoping we can carry from support. It's not easy to carry from support, man. Like when we, uh... When we get like a full on true, true, I'm going to call it a true support build because we are actually trying to build support. I just want to be able to do damage from it. Right. So we're just building items that do both. Yeah, you know, we'll have to see. We'll see what happens. The big thing is just whether or not we get follow up. See, so might get a clap the Jingwei. She's getting greedy. Then getting kind of bopped all game. I wish we had our blink already, man. Oh, it'd be so good right now. Be afraid. Look at this. Look at this bait. Ooh, because then we get one of those. She wasn't ready. Look at that. Oh, my God. We padded some stats. Yeah, if you guys ever. Yeah, you think you actually just sit in place for memes? No, no, no. You tactically sit in place because they think you're going to meme. And then, <laughs> and then you get free proc from this and you pad your stats and nobody ever takes your top damage. Oh, my God. This strat's just too good. Get soloed. Well, okay. I mean, I like follow-up, <laughs> but I kind of wanted to see if we could solo him. <laughs> By the way, our one is already up because Silph Pant... Wait, did I just never get it up? Wait. <laughs> no, I started with the one, didn't I? It is actually just already up. Okay, okay. <laughs> I think that was Silph Passive. I think we, uh... I don't know. Maybe it was actually that long. I'm kind of surprised it was up already. Bing. Because you totally needed it. Huge pull! One of these days, it's going to happen. I'm telling you guys, it's going to happen. And everybody's going to see it. And they're going to be like, oh, shit. Speaking of oh, shit. Oh, my God, we're farming. OK, well, we also get farmed, but we are farming. God, pull. Oh, we got a, you guys see that? We got a little bit. We didn't get the perfect 180. I got part of the timing. I just didn't get the perfect timing. Come here so I can heal you. OK, OK. Knocked around like a rag doll. Please! Well, I think I might be dead. Oh, do they not care that much? I want to get a pull, but the pull needs to ma- Well, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I tried, man. I tried. 
I don't think I think the stone was still technically up too, so I don't think it even would have mattered. I did I did attempt, man. I tried to make the play. We we maybe just wasted ult, but I tried to make it. You think we somehow solo the Jingwei right here? I can bait. I can bait face a little bit. If we get perfect procs off of spikes, I bet we can kill her. And I probably got a Sunder too. Okay, well she healed a little bit. Dude, did I really int that hard? Huge juke incoming. I called it. <laughs> I guess her three was down. That's pretty good. All right, I am not going back in. In case, in case it wasn't obvious, I am not going back in on that. Morgan can have fun if she wants. Give me that blink. All right, I think we'll actually get a sentry. There's probably not that much of a point because I think I've had these words forever and we haven't placed them, but we're going to get a sentry. And we'll see if we use it. So as far as build is concerned, um, honestly, pretty bad leading magic defense this game. So, so far, not all that much. I think um, so far it's not a big deal. But as we get the Antlas rotations and as Thoth comes online, we're definitely going to need it. Because Thoth hits kind of like a potato right now. I'm really not afraid of the Thoth. But as we get deeper, he's going to actually chunk. So so for Magic D, we might actually go the, uh, the whatchamacallit, the other... I guess I, I want to say other earring, but this one's not even an earring. But, you know, the other thing in the tree. See if we can mess with that a little bit. Yeah, I'll have to see, man. I keep... Now that I see that it's like doing it when I when I turn later, it seemed like that I like partially got it off. I think we're going to try and like maybe that's all I need to do is I just need that God timing of. um. I can't immediately turn. I need to like wait a very specific amount of time and then turn and then we get the good pulls. Then we get the juice. <laughs> Dude, I love that. I love that, man. That's so cool. Hang on. Free kill for me. No skin off my neck. No. <laughs> Damn it, man, please. I know I'm support. It's good that he got the kill. But still, come on. Come on. You don't get to do that thing, Thoth. Oh, he thinks he gets to live. How cute. Be dead. <laughs> Tara? I don't, know why they, I don't know why she thought she got a fit, man. Huge po- Okay. Okay. All right, should we actually do an objective, boys? I think it's a pretty free objective. Get a little tower, too. Oh, wait, hang on. Now? Oh, I tried. I don't think we actually get a kill, do we? Yeah, he doesn't really do damage to her. All right, we got a tower. We got a purple buff. Do we get a gold? Do we actually get to do the thing? I think we might. So, uh, kind of random side note, something I'm thinking about is, um, I'm thinking about trying to mess with, like, a standing desk, and I'm kind of curious, just, like, anybody's experience, whether it's work-related, whether it's gaming, whatever, um, if you guys have, like, ex why, oh, dude, I always forget just how absurd the slow is from gold. Not, like, how slow it makes you, but how long it lasts. That shit's kind of, oh, hang on, hang on, we have to tag a wave. I'm about to get animosity. It's going to change our life. I, yeah, I know I'm leeching. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just let me let me leech a little bit, okay? And then I'll be gone. Um, yeah, if you guys have any experience with like standing desks, um, not like to have it. I, I literally already have one. Um, because I got it for non-standing reasons. I just wanted an adjustable desk. But but I am curious. Um, like if anybody wants to relay their experience with standing desk to me, um, like how how long they like to do it, how much of a difference it's made for them long term and stuff. I am kind of curious because I'm thinking about messing with that right now. I don't know if I'll use it while I record. We're still top damage. <laughs> um, I don't know if I'll use it while I record or not, but but using it in general, I think will be healthy. In the meantime, I'm going to mess more. So oh fine. I'll go murder. I'll shut up. That's not murder. That is not murder. Come here so I can heal you. Yeah, I kind of trolled. Yeah, I'm still trolling. The trolling hasn't stopped, boys. Someday it will, I promise. Huge Thunder, 34. Oh my god. You know that Morgan ult wasn't going to kill if I didn't get the 34 off. Hang on. Dude, I don't know. 
don't know what to do with myself right now. These guys are going all over the place. I gotta pick one. Alright, can we do fire? Oh, well, not, not fire, but like pyro. Huge! Look at that ward. I told you we were gonna play some. On support mode. Got this animosity, it's so hard, man. Okay, Hades might have just straight up into it. <laughs> you good? Look at him trudging away. I actually love that about this skin, man. I think the skin's kind of cool. I'm not super into it. Um, I think it's a cool enough skin, but it's so funny when he's low and he's walking away. And he's just like dragging himself. <laughs> I think that's so good. Oh my God, we already have ult back up. I guess it's actually been a while. Okay. Fair enough. But yeah, I'm thinking about messing with standing a little bit. Either while I play Smite or while I do other stuff, like while I edit and just like a normal computer things. Because I want to try and just not sit in a chair um, for like a long periods of time and then just occasionally get up and do things. I want to try and like make sure I actually have breaks. Because I've literally done it a tiny bit today. <laughs> I, can, I can already kind of feel a difference, which is probably a bad sign for, for the rest of like, like especially my Tarkov days, man. Oh my God. I could I could play Tarkov, but when I was grinding that shit, I could go eight hours straight and probably not move. My arms would move for optimal gameplay, for for God aim, and that would be it. My legs were probably just effectively paralyzed. Dude, animosity is just kind of nasty. By the way, we don't actually get to use it all that much because I'm a little distracted trying to do other things and trying to not miss everything as we saw in last fight. But, um, yeah, animosity gets amped off of our health, and then spikes gets amped off of our health, and especially spikes can hit so stupid hard when you're actually building tank. Ooh, I want to do things to him. Ooh, I want to do things to him. Oh my god, I want to do him so dirty. Give me the other one. Give me the other one. Animosity. Okay, can we check damage in a sec? So I can actually see what I gotta do. Oh my god! <laughs> I don't think that was me, but it looked good. <laughs> Dude, I don't, please, let me 180. All right, I completely made up for last fight with this fight because we just absolutely farmed. Hit abs hit every single thing, landed a bunch of animosity autos. Do big FG. Yeah, we can't do big FG. We don't have our ADC and Pele's dying. You don't get to come here. I'm being super greedy and trying to save the pole for when it'll be better. Like now. Yeah, I still, I just can't get it. I think it's because it's too instinctive for me right now. I don't really try and mess with the timing too much. It's enough for me to just land the Sylve Pole, considering I really don't play this god. I think I have him ranked two. So, maybe I have him ranked three now. I've played him a few games the past couple days. But, yeah, it's, it's enough for me to land the pole. It's so much tougher when I'm trying to think about, like, exact timing and, and trying to 180, and, and maybe it'll happen. I don't know. Complicates everything, man. Nice. Huge invade incoming. Oh my god, the value. Yeah, I think just because people are going to want to see it, I think I'll go Earring right here. Because it's actually a pretty good item. And I don't think there's anything we particularly need. We just kind of, in general, magic defense will be good. So, so hopefully Earring will, will actually have an impact. We'll have to see. Yeah, give me one of these. And then, I'm assuming just Spirit Robe will be fine, right? I don't think we need anything... Um, in particular, and probably just go some mixed prots. Look at the health. Look at the 4,200 health. <laughs> we don't even have a green buff. It's actually just straight up. This is just normal health. That's crazy. Yeah, the spikes, uh, they straight up released, I think, today, the bonus update. And spikes are getting nerfed by 50 health and 5 prot. Which is which is like a solid nerf. It's going to be noticeable. Um, I don't think it's enough to matter too much. I think it's doing a good, jo good job of keeping it from being quite as much of just meta power spike item. Of just being a stat stick. But for any gods like Sylph who can actually make effective use of it, it's still going to be really solid. It's going to be capable of a lot. See, I think if the boys want to group, we can probably try and get a good fight around fire. See, does Jingwei get greedy? Do I get a solo a girl? No. Oh, she might have messed up. Hang on. Come here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Jing beads. I am gonna hope that if she didn't beads, that ult would have landed. I'm I'm not totally sure. I'm pretty. She was one. She was one. I kind of slowed myself with the auto. I'm pretty sure it would have. Oh my god, it would have been bad if not. That's okay. Getting Jing beads is actually pretty valuable. 
Hopefully we don't desperately need our ult for this fight right now. Which we might. Boys, I'm coming. That's nice. They don't even need me. Look at this. They're all grown up. Get back here. Oh. I guess he's out of range. Huge. Oh. Can you not block the huge poke, please? I was going to get the nice little AoE on their squishies. It was going to be fat. Give me this. Be afraid. We actually might get a... Hang on. Hang on. Hey, huge follow-up. Body blocks. Yeah. Little bit. Not enough follow-up. That's okay. Okay. I got moon bounce, but it did no damage. Oh, I want to do things to him. We should really do fire. We should we should just do pyro and see if we can set up for FG. As much as I want to murder, maybe they actually come here and we get to murder. It's just less immediate. Eh. I think we actually start this in gang. Okay. Set up an ambush here. Yeah. Oh, oh, we're going to set up an ambush. Are you kidding? I swear that was a good play. <laughs> Stupid pull takes too long, man. <laughs> Honestly, if I didn't Sunder, maybe it would have worked. Oh? Do we actually get to catch him? God, it's so hard to get to him right now. Oh, no, it's all going terrible. Hang on. Okay, we did farm damage. Get him! See, I keep getting, like, just enough timing that we can kind of do a, a 90 degree angle, but that's not that helpful. I thought <laughs> you don't win these. Oh, oh. I got too excited. I got too excited. I'm stopping. Get out. I really, I wanted to make a play right there. Could you tell? Could you tell that I desperately wanted to make a play and I might have gone a little too far? All right, let's try and get level 20 real quick. Look at this, a support game where it doesn't go 40 minutes and we actually get a hit level 20. And I'm not just pretending to be support, I'm actually being support. That's crazy. Getting to farm? Oh my God. I think, is there any item that stands out right now? I really just, I don't think our build matters that much in terms of like uh, specific defenses or anything or like counter building. I think we're really chilling. Like I don't need a winged blade. A lot of times Sylvanas and Emir, those like immobile supports can uh, can really suffer from that. Or like Magi's, a lot of time we need some sort of um, way to just make sure we can keep moving. And it's really not a big deal so far. Like a lot of time Magi's would just end up being a waste, I think. Okay, we probably shouldn't go to that. If anything, just because I'm so slow that even if they get to kill her, I probably just don't catch up. So not a big deal. You know, let me actually, maybe we need to spam. We don't need build. We need to spam wards so I don't look bad at the end of the game because I'm going to look bad. Right now, I think we're on like two. Give me this. And one of these. Oh, he's not ready. Look at that. Look at that spike damage. Oh my God. Okay, Morgan's dying. Rip. Can you? Over here. Come here. God, that heal is so good, man. <laughs> Oh my god, please. Bing. He's dead, right? I don't have to one yet. I can do that and miss it. It's important that we save the one so that we can miss it when we save it. God, look at the the cooldown, man. I actually got the timing right on that one, I think. I don't know really what it was. Oh my god, I'm too clean. <laughs> I don't think she juked. I think that was just easy. <laughs> All right, I think if we rush it, we can do fire. If they're... Boys, you are chasing... Please come here. <laughs> You're chasing so deep for no reason. It's literally just making it easier for them to get here. Pele, you better clap this thing. We don't have a Heim. This man's going to take two years. Oh, he's getting close, though. Hang on, here comes the damage. God, can we be greedy and wait for Morgan? Did I, wait, did I kill it? <laughs> did she get it? <laughs> I didn't think I would hit it that hard. I think I killed it. <laughs> oh my God. No, tell me it's not so. Tell me she got it. Thank God. Oh. <laughs> Animosity is too broken, man. I'm so used to the support autos not really mattering. So I just started hitting it again. And uh, they matter when you go, when you go Animosity.
when you like more than double their damage, it does it does make a difference. Oh my god, man. Oh, does it do more to bosses? I don't, is it just structures? Oh, they changed that. Okay, okay. Be right back, right? It used to do some sort of nonsense like that. Ooh, actually, why sentry nothing when we can fire blink somebody? That'll be good. That'll be kind of nasty. I don't even know who we can actually kill right now. It feels like it's so hard to get to anybody. And just straight up. I, I just want to do some one-shot nonsense, and they're too mobile, man. Jingwei literally counters me. She just gets a dash out of ult, so she's a pain in the ass. Plus, she's crazy mobile to begin with. Thoth has just, you know, good old Thoth mobility. They have two tanks, and then they have Thor. And normally Thor is off being a sneaky little shit. Murder! Murder! Okay, thank God. It was taking a little while for that to do damage. Okay, did I troll us? They do just have five people here for some reason. Boys, I'm sorry. How am I alive? Oh no. Man, I tried to peel a little bit. Hang on. Wait, we actually gonna get to the boys? Okay, stop. Urgh! I tried. <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> oh my god, if we just got the pull off, I think I live. That sucks. Okay, the fight turned out good. It's fine. Yeah, I really thought we just got to kill Thoth and Dip, and they're just, like, maybe a Thoral was going to happen, maybe, and then we could have dealt with that, and they're just, for some reason, there was just five people. Which, if we didn't have fire, and we're about to five-man siege with fire, you know, makes more sense. I'm kind of surprised they were that grouped up when, you know, they're just expecting the siege to happen. It looks like it worked out okay. Don't mind Hymet doing 400 damage autos to Phoenix. It's balanced, I promise. I can't talk shit. I probably do like 200 damage on to Phoenix just because of animosity. Just because this item's kind of dumb. To be fair, it's not normally dumb, but it's kind of dumb on Sylve. It's actually pretty good. I wonder, do I sell anything in this build at this point? Probably not, right? It's a, Relic Dagger's a little clunky at this point. Because uh, cause fights are more drawn out. They're, they're, they're slower at this point. I don't know. We should be fine. We died one time, basically 2v5, is when we took almost all the damage. So, you know, I think we have enough defense. Because I don't know how we build enough defense to, to live in the 2v5. Not normally something you should expect. Oh, my, it's so nice. Can we get... Can we get some sort of just inherent animosity that just works for PvE? It doesn't have to work on jungle bosses. I don't care. Just on camps. Camps and minions, man. Please. Give the support some love. I don't even play support, and I and I just need the love. I just need to feel it for once in my life. Do I just... I guess I just do no damage compared to gold HP? Okay. I thought it was bugging, man. I thought we were getting, like, the totem bug. Eh. Hey, Hades. Yeah, you come in to help, but they're not. Okay, I'm assuming uh, we probably just ward up fire. I don't think we're really going to push here. I'll try not to troll. We'll try and group next fight. Come here. We'll get the timing again. I believe in the timing. Hang on. It's actually... It actually could get so good. Eh. You don't get it. Okay. <laughs> Can I get follow up when I call attack one time, man? I feel like I've been pretty good about like about showing my. Ooh, we're just too clean with it. Showing my intentions. This game is support and what I plan to do. I feel like that sounded like when I like going for your daughter. No, like <laughs> my intentions with your daughter, sir. I've been pretty straightforward. Oh, I needed it. Can you stop doing damage, please? Yeah, take some back. Nice. I'm assuming we could end here and Thoth doesn't somehow 1v5. Please don't kill me, sir. I've worked hard for this KD. Just, just in case, right? Damn it. <laughs> I wanted it. I had to pad stats. Nice. GG, man. That was a fun one. That was a good game.
Yeah, I feel like that's so tough. I've been getting better lately. I've actually been working on it. I know I've talked about it in some videos. Did we get it back? Oh, it's too easy. Um, <laughs> but uh, I know I talked about it in like at least a video recently about trying to work on VGS anymore. I've been working on it. And I feel like a lot of the time now, I just like, I'll do it. And then it just doesn't matter anyways. So a lot of the stuff I thought I would get out of it is just like, people don't listen. People don't watch. You get what you get. And we did do top damage almost by a lot too. Heim came close and that was it. Plus, plus top healing because somehow Morgan and Hades didn't get it, believe it or not. Yeah. So I think the build is pretty good because we built, we can, we can peek it, right? We built this. Which I feel like, other than just the fact that there's new items, it very much looks like a support build, right? Um, like, shitload of prot, ton of health, ton of prot, ton of health. These are all just normal support items you guys have seen before. Um, <laughs> the, Sunder, the Sunder Scorching Blink is a little different, but oh my god, is it capable of some stuff, man. And uh, yeah, I think it's kind of nutty. I think it's pretty sick. And and I think I want to mess with a, a similar build on some um, on some other gods soon. We'll have to see. Like, probably not being able to abuse the the new items as much like mana core spikes and stuff but maybe getting to use the the ring a little bit more the fey blessed is it hoops fey blessed hoops a little bit more and then getting to use that new upgraded sunder because oh my god the sunder damage man if somebody wants to be a mega nerd and count our total sunder damage i bet it's like i bet it's like 5k i bet it's close and and almost all of it would have been once we upgraded it given we upgraded it like level eight so that doesn't mean much but anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video and I will see you all in the next one. I've been seeking for the glory. Say, say, say my name. And I've been trying to wrap my own story in the search for fame. I'm sitting here in this empty room. Walls keep tumbling down.